Darko Stozic is a heavy underdog right, or a heavy favorite right now against uh, Kennedy Zikukwa, Zikuku. Um, Kennedy seems like a good dog to me. And this is why. He's 6'5". His reach is 83 inches. Darko Stozic, he's 6 feet tall. Reach 76 inches. Now this guy's going to have a 7-inch reach advantage going into this fight. Um, that head kick is there all day for Kennedy. He got uh, Paul Craig with it in the first seconds of his fight versus him. And Darko gets caught with that a lot. He fought, um, he fought Devin Clark his last fight. Close decision. But he got rocked. By Devin Clark. Now, Devin Clark's no slouch, but he's also not a striker. He also has a two inch reach advantage on Stoizic. He just hits Stoizic right up the middle. No, it's left. Jab and just like fucking rocked Stoizic. Then Stoizic had him rocked. But uh, Dan Hardy was talking about how Stoizic only has like bursts of energy. Because he's so fucking like. Just yoked um, his huge back muscles. And he just like throws little bursts, but after that, he has to take like a few minutes off and just rests. So he has a Jew of black belt, but Kennedy, he's got that seven inch reach, those long limbs. Um, that head kick is there all day for him. I'm sure Stoizic's coaches saw that. Hopefully, they did. But um, his fight, Stoizic's fight before Devin Clark against uh, Jeremy Kimball. Jeremy Kimball got him with that head kick. But also rocked him, but also went in and got hit with a Stoizic fucking hook. And that'll kill anybody. So if Kennedy is a cuckoo, sorry if I'm saying that wrong, probably am. Um... If he could stay on the outside, that head kick is there all day for him. Just because uh, he got caught with it with Kimball, and he didn't make the adjustment and got caught with it by Devin Clark. Jeremy Kimball is much uh, shorter than he's six, six foot 72 inch reach. Got him with those kicks. Now Kennedy's legs are fucking long. I just saw his profile picture, I think, on Typology, and it just, like, cuts him off here. He just looks like he's, like, a fat heavyweight, but this dude is legit. He's a light heavyweight. He's got the body of John Jones, except he's, he's a little shorter, but he's the real deal when it comes to striking. Now, Paul Craig was trying to take him down and choke him out, which was his only option when he learned that Kennedy was going to outstrike him. So Kennedy rocked Paul Craig at the beginning of their fight with a head kick. Um, his punches are fast, too. I like him as a dog for Stoizic. I know I picked him. I picked Stoizic early on in my paper predictions. Um, he's a heavy favorite here. Or he was a heavy favorite to beginning. At the beginning... Kennedy was at like a plus 150 on DraftKings. Now he's at a plus 105. But that hit kicks there all day. And if Stoizic didn't make the adjustments between uh, Jeremy Kimball and Devin Clark, then he's probably not going to make the adjustments from Devin Clark to Kennedy. Um, I got Kennedy... Stoizic, alternate round one to two would be a good bet. A lot of people are going decision for this, but I think Kennedy's going to end him in the first round just by a head kick. He's got those long ass legs. Stoizic get, wants to get in the on the inside, push you up against the fence, ground and pound you if he can get you down on the ground. He probably can't. And uh, I'd bet against Kennedy his last fight because uh, I didn't think his grappling was good. But the way he was able to stop Craig, Paul Craig's takedowns 
and uh, here's some good, you know, grappling off the fence, some good clinch work. So this is going to be a classic strength versus leverage, I think. Just the uh, five and shorter Stoizic, still six feet tall. These two are giants, but Stoizic, <clears throat> he's not going to be able to get inside on Kennedy. Kennedy's just too quick. He's too long. Kennedy by TKO or alternate round one to two or Kennedy Zekulu round one or alternate round one. Stoizic did rock Devin Clark, did beat Jeremy Kimball in first round. So alternate round one, alternate round two, round one to two. Uh, Kennedy Zekulu round one, Kennedy Zekulu round two. If he tires Stoizic out, um, Stoizic came out in the second round versus Devin Clark, just exhausted. And he just was like standing there with his, he has a good tight grip. But over here, that leg of Kennedy can get around that guard pretty easily. Hit him in the back of the temple. Stoizic's a goner. Uh, Kennedy, Sakubu, TKO. Um, it's probably going to be a little bit of a favorite. I mean, underdog, obviously, but. Um, safe bet, alternate round one to two, um, or Kennedy Zakuwu round one to two, Kennedy Zakuwu TKO.